Hi, my name is Maggie Moore and I'm a structural engineer and project manager in Dewberry's Raleigh, North Carolina office location. Today I'm going to talk to you about concrete damage assessments. As structural engineers, we're often asked to go on site and look at concrete damage that an owner has on their property. Um, we've looked at all sorts of structures. They can range from tanks or tunnels um, to buildings or floor slabs. The first step in performing the concrete damage assessment is to perform a visual assessment. So we go on site and we take field measurements and photos of the damage and we also talk to the owner and try to get some background on when they notice the problem and what might have caused it. The second step is we come back to the office and we try to determine what's going on. What is causing the problem? So as part of this we look at, well is there a global issue? Possibly the structure is being overloaded and stressed. Or was there an isolated event that might have caused the damage such as a truck driving on the structure? We also consider, are there chemical um, that are attacking the concrete? Is it a freeze thaw problem or is there other corrosion issues going on? And sometimes it might just be a cosmetic problem. The third step is that we come up with a recommendation and an associated repair cost for fixing the issue. We often work with concrete repair product manufacturers to come up with what is the best product to use in addressing the issue. We um, want to find a product that works best for the environment. Sometimes the environment's very hot or very damp, and so we try to figure out the best solution for the owner. As part of this, we also come up with a repair cost um, that we can provide the owner, um, and typically we use recommendations from the product reps, um, historical data, and also cost estimating software to determine the repair cost. We summarize this in a report and then submit this to the owner. And so those are the three basic steps of a concrete damage assessment.